No. Not her. Me. Miss Lim I'm is your daughter. What year were you born? You are her father, Jupiter. Your daughter wrote you like 20 times, and but when even her mom died, you didn't answer. Well, she didn't even have enough money but to bury her. That was no fun. Hey, don't blame me. I didn't kill her. Oh, no. You had help. <laughs> it's a stupid thing to say. Okay, what do you want? Money? No. We I wanted Gracie, Gracie to meet her, meet her grandfather. Hi. And, and yes, yes we, need we need money, money to, to survive. Look, sweetheart, from 68 to like 72, I have five kids, maybe more. Oh, uh, half the people in that room could be my kid. It's a running joke around here. How are you, How gonna, you gonna feel, feel when you wake up one day to find, find out that, that your daughter, daughter is dead, dead like dead. Slim's mother was? And you didn't and even you didn't do, do anything, anything to help since a long time ago. <laughs> You're good. Your kid's a sweet touch, too. But you're not the first one to think of this gig, especially since that article in Fortune. So listen, I'll give you the same thing I gave the other three, six bucks. Enough to buy a sandwich. A few, I'll make it 12. Make sure you buy the kid a sandwich, too. You know, you know what? I believe that this, this originally, originally belonged, belonged to you. you. And since you're hard up, pawn it. And I'm sure it's more worth than 12 bucks.